you uh, for your time. Uh, not even 24 hours after that match and you're looking bright and cheerful. Uh, how did you sleep after the result against Kim Clijsters? Uh, not too well, I guess I'm putting on a brave face right now, but um, no, it's one of those things, it's always disappointing to lose and um, to be in a quarter final of a Grand Slam, you never want to go down. So, But I, I tried my hardest and um, just came up short. It was a tough match. Um, you know, everything when the conditions were not perfect either. So, how difficult was it playing that uh, late at night? Yeah, I mean, it's always difficult, but um, I guess I played later the night before and handled it okay. And it's just one of those things you don't expect a day session to go on for 10 hours or so and then you end up playing late, but uh, that's the way it goes. How do you scrub up? I mean, with a night, late night like that and such an exhausting emotional match and the next morning you're at Lacoste doing a photo shoot? Um, I guess that's all part of it, yeah. I said that I'd do it and um, I didn't know that it was going to be quite a, such a late night, but um, yeah, a few hours uh, less sleep than maybe I, I wanted, but that's okay, I'll catch up tonight. And is it, in one sense, is it a, a, you know, a little bit of a relaxation to do this photo shoot? It's a little bit of fun and, and uh, takes your mind off what happened last night? Yeah, absolutely. It's, um, it's nice to come here. I've ne this is a brand new building, so it looks pretty cool inside and get a good view of New York City. So I guess, yeah, it takes your mind off the tennis for a little bit and um, it's good to do something different. What's next? Uh, head home to Tampa for a week or so and then off to Asia. So get to Tokyo in a couple of weeks and play over there for, I've got three tournaments in Tokyo, uh, Beijing and Osaka. And Osaka is, the, is your first title there, out there to defend that? Yeah, absolutely. I've enjoyed playing there and actually won a 10,000 there many years ago. So um, it always brings back good memories. Sam, thanks very much and good luck for what's coming up.